hi guys it's michelle today i'm going to be taking you through my summer refresh for my dining room also known as my kitchen nook so i'm going to show you what i did and so let's go ahead and get started okay so on the table i have it set in a silver and white color scheme i absolutely love it and i just have a pop of color right in the middle with the centerpiece so the table setting super affordable the um, napkin ring which i'm getting ready to show you i diy that that used to be a keychain and the charger is from amazon the plate is from the dollar tree and the silver and white plates are actually from marshall's and this beautiful silver wine glass that's from home goods and this placemat, it has like the silver detail in it. That's from Pier 1. And I got that when they were going out of business. And I believe I paid like $1.50 each. The centerpiece, I kept very simple. Just some silver candle holders with some LED candles. And just a pop of color with these tulips right here. And that tulip centerpiece is from Home Goods as well. So right now in the room, which I'm going to show you around the entire room. But I'm going to take you over here to this wall where I have the mirror. Even though this room has a lot of, a lot of windows, a mirror is always good to reflect light in a room. The lamp in front of it is from Lowe's and it does cast a really nice um, light at night. But I wanted to put a mirror because I do have very dark cabinets. And over here, the curtains, I'm using these tie bags. They actually have like a magnetic clip on them. Um, I absolutely love these. I move these around the house a lot and I love the touch that it adds to this bay window. Sometimes I remove them and I just let the curtains hang all the way down to the floor. But right now I'm just loving the way it looks at the moment, especially with the silver and white that I have on the table. Okay, over here in the bay window is where I have my bar cart. The bar cart is from Ross. It was like $69.99. And just about everything on the bar cart is either from Home Goods. Ross um, and I did get one thing from Z Gallery which I'm going to show you in a minute all the glasses are from home goods this is from Ross beautiful um, I have this container here holding some of my wine stoppers that most of them are from home goods as well up on the top shelf here is where I have these um, little flamingo picks that I got from Z Gallery it was when they were running a sale on these and they are super cute. Um, the cakes, the cake stand is from Home Goods, and I have these full muffins here. They are from Amazon um, because I was tired of the muffins going, you know, getting stale. So I decided to go with these full muffins, and I absolutely love the way they look because they look so realistic. And I can't wait until Home Goods reopens in my area. I've heard that they will reopen next week, but I'm gonna wait a little bit before I actually go to the stores. So have they reopened the stores in your area? Let me know in the comments if they have or not. But I'm going to take my time about getting back out and everything. So guys, this is an overview of what the dining room looks like. And I did put that gather sign at the top just to fill that space in between the curtains. And on the left side of the table, I put this large mosaic vase on the floor. And I put some hydrangeas and some some silver stems in it. And this vase is from Burlington. I believe it was $39.99. So it was super affordable. And these chairs, these chairs used to be in my formal dining room. I decided to bring it in here to give a little bit of contrast to with this dark table. And I love the nail head trim on the chairs. The chairs, I got them years ago from the at home store and I actually got them at 50% off so it was a steal so guys I'm gonna give you another view of the dining room um, if you have not seen my last video which was my living room tour you can kind of see a view of my living room over there uh, I do have it linked below in the description box so definitely check that out and guys if you like home decor decorating or anything home related go ahead and click that subscribe button so you don't miss out on anything. I want to thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next one.